Hello children, hope you all are well at home. I welcome you all in the first video of our science class. Today we are going to discuss the first chapter. The name of the chapter is Food and Feeding Habits of Animals. We all know that food is very very important for all of us. We need food to live, to grow and to stay healthy. Food gives us energy to work. You all love to play, I think. So, for playing, you need energy. Where from you get that energy? Yes, of course, you are right. You get that energy from the food that you eat. The healthy food that you eat. So, in the same way, animals also need food. Different animals eat different types of food. Based on their eating habits, animals have been divided into three groups. Let us see what are the three groups. These are herbivores, carnivores and omnivores. So, we are going to discuss first about the herbivores. Herb, the word herb means plant. So, from here we get the clue that the animals that eat only plants are called herbivores. So, other name for herbivores is plant eating animals. Let us write some examples. So, the common examples are cow, goat, sheep, Yes, deer, zebra, etc. So all these animals, they eat only plants. It may be the leaves of the plant, it may be roots of the plant, it may be any part of the plant. So plant eating animals are called herbivores. Let us discuss about carnivores. Carnivores are those animals that eat the flesh of other animals. So flesh eating animals are called carnivores. So you may say carnivores or flesh eating animals. Let us write down some animals who are carnivores. So you all know tiger, we know lion, then croco, Dive, etc. These are carnivores. So these are the animals that eat flesh of other animals. So here we have discussed herbivores means plant eating animals. Carnivores means flesh eating animals. Let us move to the third group and you will be surprised to know about omnivores. So the animals that eat both plants and flesh of other animals are called omnivores. We humans, we love to eat chicken, we love to eat fish, we love to eat mutton, we also love to eat vegetables. So we are the best example of omnivores. So let us write some more examples. So other than humans, we got crow. You can see crows flying here and there. We have bear. Then rats are also omnivores. We have pigs. So these animals are called omnivores because they eat both plants as well as flesh of other animals. So here children we have discussed about the types of animals, herbivores, carnivores and omnivores. And we have also written the examples of these three types of animals. I hope you all have understood the terms, the words, herbivores, carnivores and omnivores. So, it is my request that please go through this topic. Those who are having books, you can go through it. And those who are not having, I guess we have sent the links for the PDF files. So kindly read this topic and 
If you face any difficulty, if you have any problem, please feel free to discuss in our Zoom session. So hope you all that you should stay well, stay safe at home. Thank you.